This smells amazing. It's got that bonfire night smell, that treacle, the butter. Hi everyone, welcome to Backyard Chef Farm Rick. Today we're in Yorkshire, my home county. We're making Yorkshire parking. Now this is a very famous sticky cake that we associate with bonfire night, the 5th of November, commemorating the failed gunpowder plot of 1605. Now, it's just a shame they didn't blow it up, but there you go. <laughs> okay, this is a very sticky cake. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it in the high sapienta air fryer. You can make it in your own oven. And even though we're going to make it, we might not taste test it. That's sacrilege in Yorkshire. You need to keep the cake wrapped up for three days till it goes really sticky and all the flavors melt together. Okay, there are all sorts of recipes around and people say you have to use uh, steel cut oats, this oat, that oat, it doesn't really matter. You know, this recipe actually came about by using oats. Now it was a staple for the poor way back in the time and then the spices were introduced into this. Now, that means that the parking back in those days was a very plain type of cake. Then all the spices were started to be introduced, which made this cake into a very luxurious, mildly spiced cake that we know today. So, even though everybody bleats on about rolled oats, steel cut oats, all this carry on, you can make it with any oats and to make it really accessible around the world, we are using quick oats, porridge oats, whatever you want to call them. Now, these are fairly ground up already. They are very, very small, but what you can do, just move that tray, what you can do is give them a quick blend. So don't worry about it. Just get it in a little blender and we can give that a little blend. So you can use any type of oats that you so wish. Don't stress about the oats. That is it. No more than that, as we're going to end up with flour. So that is going to give us that nice texture in there. Now what you do is, you forget all about porridge oats and all the rest of it. Put some of those in there for more texture. Okay? And then you blend the rest. So then you have that nice oatiness in there, but you have those textured ones as well. That's your oats in there. That's nice and straightforward. So we're going in there with our flour and we're going in there with our spices. Just give that a mix through. Get it all fully incorporated in there the best you can. It's a very quick recipe this. Very quick, there's no messing around. You throw it all together and then you put it in a pan or a tin and you cook it. It's as easy as that. Okay, we want a flame on. Not too, not too high in there with our butter. In there with our golden syrup. Now golden syrup cannot be interchanged. Cannot. It's a distinct flavor. In with some brown sugar. Let's have all that stirred in, start melting it down. Okay, and this is black treacle. Now you can use molasses, not a problem. So just give that all a stir in. So as soon as you've got it combined, 
off with the flame, put to one side. So straight in there with our butter sugar mixture. Now we're going to stir that through in there. Get that fully incorporated in there. And then in with our milk, stir that through. And then our egg mixture. in our tree. And get that in the oven. Now this is going on the middle shelf in this oven. Now it has a high fan and a low fan on this which makes it perfect for this kind of recipe and we are going to set the time to 40 minutes 140 degrees 40 minutes low fan let's see what happens as clean as a whistle let's have that out of there Look at that. Oh, that is wonderful. Now, let me hold this up. You can see on here, it's cracked round. Don't worry about it because we're going to turn it over when we actually wrap it. Okay, so we're just going to let it cool a little minute and then we're going to wrap it in parchment paper. And we're going to turn all that over like that and then we're going to take that off there hopefully Whew. so have that off there can't pick it up with this on all right let's get that off there this smells amazing. It's got that bonfire night smell, that treacle, the butter. Let's have this off here. Oh, 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 oh. look at that. That is Yorkshire parking made right there. Okay, that's our parking made now breaking with tradition you do not cut parking you wrap it up and you put it away for three days and it goes sticky and the flavors meld together but for the sake of the video i'm going to cut a slice okay so we're going to come in there and crunch through the end that is our parking look at that you shouldn't cut this but we are going to now it's too crumbly at the moment after three days it gets sticky and it all comes together all the flavors melt together is fantastic. So what does it taste like? Now this is sacrilege. This is, you should not ever do this. You should not cut into the parking, but we're having to do it for the video. Okay, we can't wait three days for it all to get sticky and everything else just to try it. So I'm gonna take a corner because it's a corner piece. <laughs> I love corner pieces and we got a little bit of a crust on there. 
Now obviously when it gets stickier, that crust is sticky crusty, which is fantastic. So what does it taste like? Well, Mm. Oh man. Oaty, gingery. Bit of a treacle taste. Not sweet. Not sweet at all. That is absolutely delicious. Got that ginger in there. Oh. And those mixed spices. When it's wrapped up, left for three days, and all those flavours come together, it gets a little bit stickier. Mmm. That is really nice. That is really nice. Well, if you like what we're doing, don't forget to smash that like and subscribe, share with your friends, all that kind of stuff. And we'll catch you in the next video.